How to make a robot that can go where people go, do useful things in a world designed around people, and navigate the human world. That human-centric approach takes a real depth of understanding, knowledge, and experience. It's one thing to build a robot that looks like a human. It's far more challenging to build a robot that moves like a human and captures the same physics to enable the same performance. Human-centric robotics is challenging because our space is relatively unstructured compared to being able to design the environment around the robot. And so as robots get a little bit more intelligent, that's certainly a really necessary piece of it. But the other piece of it is the physical interaction. When you build a robot that's able to go where people go, that's something that Agility has really pioneered and excels at. We have so much complexity, so many things that come into play. Um, and we want Digit to be able to interact with all of those things and handle them dynamically, handle people in situations and totes in unknown locations, things like that, and, and be able to still do its job safely. This new iteration of Digit is a culmination of over two decades of research and development. Now it's time for us to take these robots into the real world and deliver value to our customers, eventually paving the way to general purpose robots that are part of our everyday life. Our dream is to build robots that free us from robotic tasks, that enable humans to be more human. And everything we've built, every breakthrough, is part of the journey towards that goal. And that's where Digit is going. Digit is made for work.